Imagine it's the hottest day of summer and you're holding your favorite ice cream cone, but no matter how long you wait, it doesn't melt, not even one tiny drip. Strange, right? Melting is something we see all the time. Ice turns into water, butter gets gooey, and crayons become a colorful mess if you leave them in the sun. But what actually happens when something melts? Everything around you is made of teeny tiny bits called particles. In a solid, those particles are packed close together, like kids standing still in a group hug. But when things get warmer, those particles start to wiggle and bounce. If it gets hot enough, they start moving so much that they break apart from their tight hug and begin to slide around. That's when a solid turns into a liquid. Each thing melts at its own special temperature. Ice cream melts quickly, but rocks need lava-level heat. Melting helps candles drip, metal get shaped, and grilled cheese stretch perfectly. Now imagine a world where nothing melted. No candles on birthday cakes, no gooey marshmallows by the campfire, and worst of all, no melty pizza cheese. That world would be pretty dry, stiff, and not very fun. Melting is a kind of magical change that makes the world softer, smoother, and sometimes even tastier. So next time your popsicle starts to melt, smile and remember, it's just a tiny heat-powered science show happening right in your hand. And that's it for today's big question, friends! Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell so you don't miss our next adventure! Bye-bye for now!